so basically today I wanted to talk about quite a serious topic that's going around the CSGO community right now and it's a new scam that's actually arose and that is these scammers are going to people with 40 to 50 dollar knives saying that they will buy them a game such as GTA 5 or Overwatch or just a game within that 40 to 50 dollar range now what they will do is that they will get you they will give you the gift first and then of course you will give them your knife and you will of course go away thinking well I've just gained a game from a knife that I wouldn't have gotten as much money for because of course as you know Steam takes 5% of however much you sell the item for I just wanted to say also that the only reason I know that this scam actually exists is because multiple of my friends have been telling me about it through Steam message saying, hey, I just got scammed. He revoked his gift. So basically the scam is, is that the scam will have, say, $40 in their Steam account, which they will buy a game for you and gift it to you. You will then give them your knife and that you will think that is a fair trade, but it is not because they will come back, they will revoke their gift. That means that they will not only get their money back onto their Steam account, but they will be getting your knife because you've traded it to them. And this method should not be going around. It is scummy to scam people. You are taking the money that they have worked for. It's not right. And this is where Steam should introduce a system where if the gift is going to be revoked, then the person that the gift is being revoked off, then they should be able to say whether the, whether the gift being revoked is correct or incorrect because then if it's a scam that's going to minimize it because that will go to a review panel at steam steam needs to minimize scamming not maximize it anyway i just wanted to get this video out there thanks for so much for the support lately it's been amazing thank you all for watching and i'll see you in my next video peace